Hello there. I wanted to quickly stop by and show you a very simple template that I've created to help me get my reveal wheels in place. And I have two ways to create it. Um, one requires the um, templates that Lanfon offer. Um, this is much easier, but you can also do it without a template. I will show you both ways. So the simple one is to use the template. So I have created a die cut a reveal panel with the um, arc cutout, and I have the coordinating template. And you just can line them up and mark the position of that hole. And then we can just poke a hole with a needle but before we do that I will show you how to do it without the template so I have another um, panel here and what I have to do is I have to measure um, the middle of the shorter side and the middle of that half circle so let's do that And to, to find the middle of that half circle, um, it might be easier to use your, your grid mat. And then find that point. So these should be in the same direction uh, in the same position. So we can double check that. And you can see, yeah, we have the same position. And what I just did, I went ahead and just put a hole in that marked spot so and I will show you how this is intended to work um, I have cut a uh, wheel and just for demonstrating purposes I marked the um, window parts and what I do is I I start to build my reveal wheel as I would originally do. So I take my little circle and put the bread through that little one and the reveal wheel. And then instead of closing the breads, I also feed it through that hole and then I close it. So, and as you can see, my my wheel is in the perfect position here and when i now go ahead and put my adhesive on that small circle I can go ahead and align that with my back panel. So I have created a back panel without a cutout. And then I just go ahead and align the two panels, press down, open the prongs, remove my template and close the bread again. And now, I can go ahead and place my um, 
my decorated panel on top with the foam adhesive and my review wheel is in perfect position. So I hope this will help you to facilitate creating your review wheels and I wish you a creative time. See you, bye!